Hey, good afternoon, everyone. Gary B, the casual comic guy here. And um, we got quite a few things for the channel today. Um, I got a series shout out to do on someone else's channel, which I think is really awesome. And we'll do it at the end of the video. I got some cheap keys I bought today. And I got an AOK -okay from Slotted Up 503. Thank you, Jason. Um, <clears throat> but to start out, We'll go with the cheap keys, and these are keys that you can get for barely anything. Who knows what might be the next ultimate Fallout 4, a dollar bin die that turns into a huge, huge book. So, I believe this first key I have, I saw it on another channel, I can't remember, but I'm going to give the credit to, hopefully not mistakenly, to uh, Russ on um, Collect What, another great channel you guys should check out. But this is... The first appearance of Mephisto's daughter, or um, the daughter, yep, and uh, this is issue six of Doctor Strange. So who knows if she might show up sometime, but it's worth having it. $3 buy, near mint condition, not a thing wrong with the book, barely read. And that goes for the rest of these I'm showing. It looks like they've never been used. Uh, this <clears throat> isn't so much a key as in... Um, I like collecting these odd books. So I have Smokescreen, which was a Marvel book with Storm, Power Man, and Spider-Man, which talked about kids smoking. It was like a PSA book. This is another one. This was uh, three, um, three different number ones. This is the one I have right here, the Amazing Spider-Man, Skating on Thin Ice with a McFarlane cover. Just an anti-drugs book. Just really cool stuff. There was a hit and run, and... And now I can't. Now that I'm live, I can't remember the name of the third one. Oh well, <laughs> maybe another day. And this uh, looks like it's never been cracked. That's how minty fresh this is. This is the Amazing Spider-Man Annual number twenty-two, and that's the first appearance of Speedball, which is this guy right here. Who later became went to the New Warriors, then he became another character whose name I can't remember at the moment. But um. If he ever pops, this is one of your uh, cheaper books that's going to go up in value, all right? So that's our uh, first appearance of Speedball. This is so, so, so minty fresh. Not a bend, a tear, or a ding on it. All right. Then we have The Amazing Spider-Man 406. The first Carolina Seward, I think, as um, um, Dr. Octopus, her first full appearance in the costume, but... Uh, Another one that you never know. Again, I paid $3 for each of these. Super cheap. If they don't pop, they don't pop. I still got good reads. If they do pop, well, I only paid $3. So I'm not into it for much. And this last one, paid $3. Everyone's going to know this one because this is one of the more popular ones that people do know about. And this is uh, Batman 457. Ah, uh, yes, Jason, I have a Batman book. Uh, you too, Taylor. So this is the first uh, Tim Drake in, in uh, his Robin outfit. So when he first becomes Robin. Cool little story. Of course, you got the Scarecrow. All right. So that's what we had for cheap keys. So now we are going to get on to the uh, A-OK -okay from Slotted Up 503. And... Uh, him and I exchanged AOKs. Okay. So he had a book that I commented on. He goes, you know, if you want it, it's yours. And I'm like, well, I'm not just going to take a book from you. I'm going to send something to you. So we swapped AOKs. -okay. I'm hoping mine's better than his so I can say I gave him a better AOK. -okay, but I, I'm probably going to be wrong because Jason likes to... Uh, I think he's got a competitive streak. So And Diamond Distributor Box. You can get this at your LCS. But um, I'm pretty excited because another one. Oh, there we go. All right, nice. So this is what I like to see. He's repurposing boxes. I do it all the time to people. Send out stuff that the boxes I already have, and you don't have to uh, spend money on it, and you're helping the environment. Recycle, recycle, recycle. So. Let's see. Uh, I think he definitely overdid it. Free backing boards. Always a win. All right, so let's see. Actually, I'm pretty excited about this. All right. Lady Rawhide 1. 
I actually have Lady Rawhide one. I have a different cover, Mike Mayhew. But that's pretty cool. So that's two Lady Rawhide ones, different covers. Excellent. That'll go right with the other one. Thank you, Jason. All right, Predator number one versus Magnus Robot Fighter. All right, I'm a big Predator fan, so this is actually a book I don't have. Okay, we got Bone number 16. Cool little cover. Ah, I don't want the books to slide. All right, oh, here's the one I was originally trading for. This is uh, Conan the Barbarian Volume 1. This is uh, number one. And this is uh, the J. Scott Campbell variant and Virgin variant at that. So beautiful book. I've been wanting to add this to the collection. I have it now. Thank you very much, Jason. I really appreciate this book. Uh, oh, another fire book. <clears throat> okay, we have the J. Anacleto cover. Uh, this is just great. Look at that. And I can't remember what issue this is, but we're going to take a look. That is a beautiful, beautiful virgin variant. This is Hellions number two. Absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous book. Thank you, Jason. All right. Oh, another favorite of mine, Angela. So Angela, Queen of Hell, issue four. Beauty of a cover there. And then Species 1 of 4, the official adaptation of the movie. And actually, this is one of my all-time favorite sci-fi movies with Natasha Henstridge. And um, oh, there's so many good actors, and now I'm blanking on them. Michael Madsen, Alfred Molina, just a great cast on this movie. Uh, this one I love. Thank you very much. These are all incredible books. All right, and another J. Scott Campbell cover, Black Widow number one. That's actually my second copy of that. I am not upset to have that at all. So that is the first box. And uh, this crazy guy sent two boxes to me. So let's see what's in box number two. Vampirella Classic number two. I actually really love this cover. Look at that. That is a great, great Vampirella cover. Look at that art. Very old school art. I love it. It's like the old school horror art too, which just makes it fantastic to me. All right, you got to take another look. That's just amazing. All right, and then we have Hide 25 number zero. Bonus, the very first appearance of Vampirella, first time in color. So let's see our nice little reprint it looks like. The story behind Bishop from Vengeance of Vampirella. Another beauty of a horror cover. Absolutely gorgeous. And we have Sandman Mystery Theater. What a cool cover this is. Look at that, guys. Oh, this one I'm excited for because I have an artist that does commissions. And uh, I'm going to put this to use. Black Cat Blank. I was actually looking at this online. I don't have to. I was literally looking for this because I want to do, get a commission piece done. Thank you very much, Jason. And then we have, I don't know what this is, but this is beautiful. I'm going to look at, look at this in a second. First, I'm going to show you the cover. Looks like another, uh, I don't know. Actually, I don't know who did that cover. But that is gorgeous. All right, let me look this up. This is an Unknown Comics vari uh, variant for Crease. Never heard of it. Merca, oh, oh I'm sorry. Uh, Mercy number five. Merca and Dolphles Mercy number five variant. Gorgeous. Thank you very much, Jason. And then to round it out, we got Robocop Roulette 
issue one of four. And all these books are just minty fresh. This is a, um, this is a huge A-OK. -okay. Thank you so much, Jason. Um, I thought my A-OK -okay was pretty good, but it's not this good. This is incredible. So I'm going to owe Jason another A-OK, -okay, guys. This is, um, this is phenomenal. Uh, thank you very much, Jason. Wow. That, that's an incredible A-OK. -okay. I don't even know what to say. Thank you so much. Um, those books are going to get put to good use and some of them I just love for the collectability of the covers and the artists that I like. So thank you very much. Uh, and then we're going to, oh, I forgot something over there. One second. So I also have for my channel. So these are, uh, Jason's actually going to be the first one to get these because I mailed them out. Uh, his package, but I just got more made. Oh, I can't remember the. I'm gonna have to shout out the business here in another second because I gave away all her cards. Happy little acorn or something on um, YouTube on uh, Instagram. So these are my logo stickers. There's the Valentine's Day one. Awesome. My regular logo. And by the way, uh, these this logo was designed for me by my friend, um, Ken Wheaton, who is an absolutely incredible artist. He did this great caricature um, logo for me. And uh, there's not a style I, I've seen that he can't draw. So he's just absolutely amazing. So those are my logo stickers. Um, so when I mail stuff out to people, I'll throw a sticker in for them. Just, just something fun. And um, and I'm going to show you guys a picture. I'm going to put it up on the screen uh, right over here that you guys can see. Uh, a sketch cover variant that Ken did uh, as a commission of Wonder Woman. And it's um, Linda Carter Wonder Woman. It's beautiful. It's gorgeous. It should be right here now while we're talking. So when you guys are watching this, you'll see it pop up. It's spot on amazing um and the last thing i want to do for this video is i need to give a shout out to a cool horror series that's happening right now on another youtuber's channel so the youtuber the gray man i'll link his channel in the description down below but he's got a series going on right now which is absolutely brilliant it's called 31 nights of halloween and in it He's putting together videos of old comics. So you got Chamber of Chills, Chamber of Darkness, Secrets of Haunted House, House of Mystery, Scary Tales. And he's highlighting a horror story from those. And they're narrated and they're voice acted. And he's got music on them. And it's like a little horror episode, a little classic horror. These great old stories just put in a great little 7 to 11 minute video format. And you can sit there and it's just like you're reading a book except it's acted out there's music it's so professional it's so nice and it's just good old horror fun so if you're a horror fan and even if you're not even if you just like old nice books and you want to see something acted out nicely and, and fun and uh just professionally made please head over to the gray man's channel like i said i'll link it below and check out this series you won't be disappointed if you check it out let me know what you think the series is amazing. Every time one drops, I have all the premieres set to uh, give me a notification because they're just incredible. I absolutely love them. But um, that's pretty much it for this video, guys. Again, I want to thank Jason, Slotted Up 503. Dude, you outdid yourself. That's absolutely amazing. That's way above and beyond. Thank you so much. I'm really touched by the AOK -okay and the gift. It's incredible. Um, Stickers are cool. The low key, the cheap keys are nice. And check out the Gray Man's 31 Nights of Halloween. Until next time, guys. Um, stay safe, stay positive, be kind to each other, and keep it casual.